Hello everybody and welcome to this how-to on Google to Twitter. How to get the most out of your Google Calendar. First thing you need to make sure you do is you need to have a Gmail account for this to work. So if you don't have one, you go to gmail.com and set up your Gmail account. Along with your Gmail account, of course, you get a Google Calendar. And so we're going to go over to our Google Calendar that we already have set up with our lunch and breakfast menu from our school. I like to set up a second, a separate email account just for our cafeteria or our calendar of events and that way we don't have to worry about it on somebody else's name. So the first thing, go to settings and your calendars and you're going to go to notifications. You want to make sure that your calendar is sending you a reminder about your events. This is the first step and to get everything working. So you're going to set it to email and you can pick the amount of time before each event for your reminder. After that's done, you want to make sure you save and then we're going to need a Twitter account. So go to head and go to twitter.com, set up a Twitter account. Again, I like to set up a secondary Twitter account just for one purpose. So in this case, you can see this is for our cafeteria. Once we set up our Twitter account, we're kind of done with Twitter for now. We are going to use a secondary website to get our Google Calendar out of Google Calendar into Twitter. So we're going to use a service called twittermail.com. Once you go to twittermail.com, it's going to ask you for your Twitter username, LGHS Cafe is ours, and then your Twitter password. And when you set this up, it's going to give you a secret email address. This email address is going to be important to you later, so make sure you remember what it is or write it down. I like to make sure that my settings are correct and the most important one is you want your replies off and then you what part of we which should send to Twitter I use only the subject and that's going to be the reminder part in your email coming from your calendars after we got Twitter mail set up we are going to go back to our Gmail account and we're going to go to settings and filters and we're going to create a filter. I have our filter set up already, but so I'll just go through the edit process. You're going to use has the words and we're going to input reminder. And this is how Google sends out a calendar reminder, just like this. Then you're going to take the next step. We're going to forward it to our secret Twitter mail email. We're going to update the filter and now when our Google Calendar sends our reminder to us, it will automatically send through Twitter mail to Twitter and it will tweet out our lunch menu. The last step, and this is an optional step of course, you can use your profile. You can use your profile's RSS feed and you can now take your RSS feed with a Google gadget in your Google site and you can have a dynamically updating lunch menu for yourself. Any questions, please let me know or in the comments and thank you very much.